Hey, this is Chad with SOS Diagnostics. Today we're going over the procedure to program the immobilizer system using the red programming key. This, the models covered by this procedure are all monsters up through 2008 using a digital odometer. All 749 and 999 superbikes. All ST or sport touring models and the Multistrada up through 2009. When is this procedure used? If you need to program additional black keys, if you are replacing the instrument cluster or speedometer with a new part, not used, but new, or if you're replacing the ECU engine computer with a new factory part, again, not used. The requirements to, for this procedure are you must have your red programming key. You must have at least two black keys that are unique and correct for the uh, that style of bike. Now why do we say unique? Many people buy keys from eBay that are blank and do not have an electronic code in them. These will not work for the red key programming. Um, and you have to have at least two black keys. You can have up to four black keys for this procedure. Now, if you're missing your red key, um, that's not a problem. We have a service to provide one, and we can also help with programming used parts, used ECU or instrument cluster. If you're trying to do that, you can contact us from our website, keysforducati.com. Here we have the three original keys from this 2002 Ducati Monster 620. Um, again, remember, we have to have at least two, and they have to be correct for the model. I mean, another problem we often run into is people have purchased a key from the dealer, and they got a key for a super bike, which uses a different transponder or a different electronic code. So again, that's a common problem we see and the red key procedure will not work with that key. We also have aftermarket keys available without logo like this or a just a metal key used to uh, open the seat lock or the gas tank. Okay, the pro programming procedure goes like this. Uh, first of all, we can show you what a normal, here's your immobilizer light, flashes for 24 hours after the key is removed. Now when we turn the bike on with a valid black key, that immobilizer light should do a self-test and then do nothing. That means your system is working just fine. If you turn it on with a, the correct red key for the bike, again the light does the self-test and then gives you three quick flashes. This confirms that this is the red key and that there are a total of three keys programmed. Another tip for programming is have your keys separated. Don't have them on the same key ring. If you have too many keys uh, within the vicinity of the antenna, here this black ring that's around the lock, um, they will interfere with each other. So let's add a third or a third black key to this bike. So we'll have a total of four keys programmed, red and three black keys. So this is how we do it here. We turn the ignition on for a couple seconds and back off. Then turn on your first black key and look for the counter on the instrument cluster. Now see it counts from three, 30 to zero. Now you need to turn that key off before it gets to zero or you'll get that off message and you have to start again. So let's do it again. And red key on for two seconds. Back off. On with your first black key and it'll now be in program mode counting down. So key off before it gets to zero. On with our second black key and again off before it gets to zero. Now let's turn on our third unprogrammed key and off before it gets to zero. Now you see that counter, it's increasing, uh, goes 
two on our first black key, three on our second black key, and four now on our third black key. Counts number one as the red key. Now once we've entered our last black key, we turn it on, turn it on again with our red key. And we waited too long. <laughs> so we'll start over again. So to put it in program mode, on with the red key and back off. On with our first black key, counting down. Second black key. Third black key. And now our red key again. Back off before it gets to zero. Now leave the red key in. And let's turn it on one more time. And watch the counter. Now we got four flashes telling us we have four black keys now programmed. And the bike is ready to start. So let's test our new black key. Watch the immobilizer light. Should do the self test and then go out. All right, bike is now ready to start with our new black key. If you need service or help with your bike, you can contact us from our website, www.keysforducati.com.